Three months passed and still no solution. Hundreds of people left wondering who is held responsible for refunding their money after Lantern Fest was canceled. Channel 5's Catalina Cruz spoke to a woman who is demanding some answers. Instead of lighting up the night sky, Lantern Fest is leaving hundreds in the dark. This year's cancellation causing confusion. The event was scheduled for this Friday and Saturday. It was canceled back in June. We reported before about the event being canceled by the city of South Padre Island for fire and environmental concerns. The lanterns themselves are not biodegradable. Avid beachgoer Andrea Mata is amongst those left in limbo. She tells me she tried every way possible to get a refund, but her claim was denied for so-called government intervention. We reached out to the Lantern Fest and haven't heard back as to why her claim was canceled. We did speak to them last month. They told us they felt the city was at fault since they canceled after tickets were already being sold. We're kind of just at a standstill. We're all in limbo wondering where's our money or who can we talk to as to the path we need to, to take to get our money back. We asked the city of South Padre Island spokesperson Nikki Soto why tickets were sold if the city hadn't approved the permit. Soto was unable to provide an answer, falling back on saying that's unfortunately how the sequence of events took place. Soto says the city was contacted by Lantern Fest. The agency provided step-by-step -step instructions on how ticket holders can obtain a refund. We'll put those steps on our website at krgv.com after the newscast. In the studio, Carolina Cruz, Channel 5 News at 4.